Today I'm going to show you how to make these Rilakkuma keys inspired by this Rilakkuma key that is attached to one of the Rilakkuma Sweets plush. You can use just yellow clay but I want to make it a little shiny so I'm going to add some pearl clay. Now you can see it's a little shiny. You're going to roll out an oval for the head. Add on the ears and blend them together. Now we're going to make the stick portion. I like to put head pins through the stick portion to make them a little more stable. After blending in the stick part to the head, we are going to make the little key portion. With the rectangular piece, we are going to blend this into the stick. Here is what it should look like after you've blended it out. Now I'm going to use a Becky Bachi technique. I cut a straw in half like so. With this half kind of circle, I'm going to press it down to make the half circle on the key. Now your half circle is in the straw. Now we're going to add on the bow. You can actually make the bow any way you'd like, but I kind of like the way this looks and now you're just going to bake it after adding an eye pin. After it's baked, it should look like this and now we're just going to paint on the R. After glazing, this is what your charm should look like and that's pretty much it. Just to show you the difference, this is the pearl and the yellow clay, and this is just the yellow clay. If you look really, really closely, this one glitters just a little bit, and this one's just kind of yellow. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and I'll talk to you later.